Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Claudia Mora. As Dean of the Jackson School of Geosciences, I am honored to welcome you to the Spring 2020 commencement. The faculty, research scientists, and I take great pleasure in welcoming the graduates and their families and friends to this ceremony. We are happy to have all of you here today. Well, out there. This afternoon, we will honor the undergraduate and graduate students of the Jackson School for their work at the university by recognizing them individually. Today is a day for a thousand celebrations, and we hope you are surrounded now by people who share the joy and pride of your accomplishment. Your graduation culminates one of the most significant stages in your lives. Your university years have been a time of learning, of growth, and of meeting people whose influence will last your entire life. In the years ahead, you will often think with fondness on your college years. You will remember the professors who have taught and advised you, the readings and research that challenged you, the new friendships you have made, the loves you have lost and found anew. Your college experiences are some of the most formative moments of your lives. This university and school, the Jackson School of Geosciences of the University of Texas at Austin, have the power to nurture and enhance our students, and you leave here as part of a distinctive family. People will come to see those distinctions in you, and we hope it will give you special recognition. The University of Texas, your alma mater, is far better off because you have been its student. Before we hear from our speakers and confer your degrees, I'd like to recognize the group that makes these degrees possible, the faculty and research scientists of the Jackson School of Geosciences. Their expertise, energy, and dedication inspire the students to rise to remarkable achievement. They believe in young people, in their ability to succeed, and their right to a good education. They celebrate your achievements. The traditional regalia which, which we wear for graduation, while trimmed in colors unique to our individual disciplines and alma maters, symbolize, above all, our shared history culture, and values as members of this community of scholars. And although your classes are now over, we will always be a part of your geoscience family. I would also like to pay tribute to some of the special heroes of the day, the parents, the grandparents, and other family members of our graduates. You made today possible. You supported these students. You encouraged them to learn, to meet challenges, and to succeed. You raised them to take advantage of their own intelligence. You invested in their education and insisted on high standards so that they would have opportunities in a rapidly changing world. These students are here today because you gave them all of this and more. We thank you for allowing us to have had the privilege of helping you educate these members of your family. I ask the class of 2020 to join me in expressing your profound appreciation for a job patiently and superbly done. Graduates, from this day forward, you will be the school's ambassadors. We are delighted to have you carry forth the reputation of our school into the world. Please carry that reputation with pride. With the conferral of degrees today, each of you now becomes an alumnus of the University of Texas at Austin. And now I would like to introduce our speaker for the commencement address. Greg Robertson was born and raised in Corpus Christi, Texas, the son of Rock Robertson, an independent petroleum geologist who himself earned a bachelor's and master's degree in geology at UT Austin. Greg received his BA in English from the University of the South and then attended the University of Texas at Austin for undergraduate and graduate geology courses from 1978 to 1980. He returned then to Corpus Christi and has worked in his family's business ever since. The family-owned business, First Rock Inc., operated a well service company and drills and operates producing properties across South Texas, and it acts as consultant and project originator in several co-ventures with larger independent companies. I think you will find that Greg has an interesting story to tell about the value of his UT education, so please help me now to welcome him. <laughs> 